And as Israeli forces continue their ongoing shelling over Gaza, recent attacks in the al Magasi and al Mawasi refugee camps in central Gaza have truly shown the fact that despite what Israeli claims, there is no safe place in Gaza. Our correspondent Noor Harassin brings us all the details. Repeatedly, we always talked about how there is nowhere safe in Gaza. Civilians were killed, children were killed, doctors, journalists, even those who are non-Palestinians or with dual nationalities were killed here in uh, Gaza. And this is actually what happened inside the Al-Maghazi refugee camp. The Israeli forces stormed into the camp, uh, pounded the camp with uh, dozens of uh, shells, uh, strikes. However, this all of this happened without any evacuation order. Palestinians were forced to lay, leave their safe place to another safe places that were also uh, there is continuous Israeli bombings and uh, shillings. Actually, at the same time of the Israeli incursion in the Al-Maghazi refugee camp, the Israeli forces also attacked the Al-Mawasi refugee camp. So now Palestinians are uh, lost. They don't know where to go. They don't know where to what to do because uh, the situation and what is happening here in the ground and what we are reporting is not uh, realistic. It does not make any sense to squeeze that number of people to a small piece of land and then attack this, pe this uh, piece of land to uh, talk about how Israel is asking Palestinians to evacuate these dangerous areas but on the ground to attack both safe and dangerous areas. This is actually what happening here on the ground in uh, Gaza. Let us talk about the humanitarian aid coming uh, from Egypt. Over the past two days, Egypt allowed around 108 trucks from uh, entering the Gaza Strip. However, now there is a hardship of distributing this aid to the uh, people of Gaza. The UN operation here in Middle Gaza is very uh, slow. Hardly um, anyone here in uh, middle Gaza is receiving any humanitarian aid, adding the fact that there is zero humanitarian aid entering northern Gaza over the past days. Nuharazin Telisur, Gaza.